And as that race draws closer, W.A.Y. spoke to multiple candidates running. Chris Miller, Chris Miller stopped by our studio earlier today saying that he is happy with the momentum he feels he's gained. He said his background sets him apart, describing himself as an outsider. I'm an absolute outsider. I've never been elected to political office, and I'm not a politician. And the people out there want less politicians and less attorneys and less bureaucrats running things, and they want more business people running things. We also need to get more teachers involved and more farmers involved and more real-world people involved, and that's what the people in West Virginia are really looking for. Miller is touting his four-day plan, something he feels would set the state on the right path from beginning of his tenure in office. He said he plans to audit government spending, implement drug testing for welfare recipients, eliminate the state income tax, and begin applying those new policies on the fourth day. He said his on-the-ground campaigning is, showing, is helping show him what West Virginia voters want. That's the absolute best part because these are always, at the end of the day, about the voter. And the more you get a chance to talk to the voter, which is what we've done for the past 15 months, the better off it is. And that's why we're in the position that we're in. The momentum keeps taking off and it keeps building. And it's all because of the people in West Virginia and all the work we've done going around and listening as much as we possibly can. And that's the deal, right? It's always about the people. 